What's up everybody, it's your boy Dello Magic, AKA DMG, AKA the 2K God. I'm about to deliver to y'all some of this mama's cooking like Kwame Brown said. Anyways, man, I'm presenting y'all the PC X S2. It is an emulator for the PC. Um, it's a PS2 emulator. So I'm basically gonna be showing y'all a tutorial on how to do things. So sit back, relax, kick your feet up, eat some popcorn, and get some of this mama's cooking. Okay, everybody, this is the PCSX2 for the PlayStation 2 emulator. Um, up here you see the website, so it's gonna be in the description down below. So, you're gonna go ahead and go to download. Since my computer is a Windows, I wanna click Windows, but uh, for the people who got Linux or Mac, you also can run it as well. So go ahead and click uh, Windows. This is the current emulator for the PS2 so go ahead and click download once you click download shouldn't take no longer than three seconds to go ahead and download go ahead and minimize that you can go ahead and um, open the folder drag it out here close that go back to the browser then you want to go to Ro Rome's Mania um, I'm also gonna put this link in the description right here you need this simply to play the games. Uh, without this BIOS right here, you cannot play the game. Once again, it shouldn't take no longer than three seconds to go ahead and download it. Um, after you do that, what you wanna do, you're gonna wanna go to open file, drag it out here, exit out. So, next thing you wanna do is go ahead and open a new folder. We're gonna call it BIOS. You're gonna drag the PS2 BIOS inside the BIOS folder that we just made. Open it up. Um, I like to extract my folders with 7-Zip. Um, if you ever wanna use 7-Zip, I will put the link in the description down below. Uh, so you go ahead and 7-Zip it. Extract files here. And then once you see all this, that means you did it correctly. Go ahead and exit out. So double click this on the PCXS2 uh, icon. You wanna click normal installation, press next. And then what you wanna do is you wanna create a short uh, shortcut and a desk uh, top shortcut simply because that way you can get to it quicker. As you see on the left hand side, I have all my um, different type of emulators for the Nintendo 64, PS3, Super Nintendo. I do all that. So you want to do click next. Uh, make sure you have your uh, destination folder where you want to go. You can be on your C drive or hard drive or USB. It's up to you. Go ahead and click install. Press finish. Next. Next. So the next thing you want to do is uncheck this box right here where it says use default settings. Go to browse. Make sure you want you want to locate that folder you just um, created right there. So go to desktop, go to BIOS, select select folder. Since I am in the USA, I will click the USA. If you in Japan or Europe, you click one of those. Then you go ahead and click finish, and that's it. So next thing you want to do, go to config, go to video, go to plugin settings. This right here is um, the default settings right here. So I use OpenGL. If OpenGL doesn't work for you, you can use one of these other ones. Play with it around. Next thing you wanna do is uh, you wanna go to internal resolution. So basically, since my computer is a, a 1080p, I mean my monitor is a 1080p, I will click 3x native, but if you want to go higher than that, you need a uh, monitor that can uh, has a resolution of uh, 4K, 3K, all that kind of Ks. Y'all, it's up to y'all, man. Y'all know what y'all computer can hold. Next thing you want to do is go to Tropic Filtering. Uh, you can do uh, two times, four times, x times, or 16 times. Basically, what that does is just sharpens the picture, makes it pop out a little bit more. So I prefer to go eight times. And after that, you press OK. So 
So then when you want to go back, my preference of uh, some people probably want to uh, probably want to do this. Go to video. Uh, you want to go to window settings. So right here, the aspect ratio it starts at standard 4:3. I like to make it a widescreen. Also, you want to sit here and click default to full screen mode to open. Press apply. Press OK. And then for your configuration, um, you can use a PS4 controller. You can use an Xbox One controller. Since I'm a Sony guy, I love using my PlayStation controllers. So what you want to do is connect the controller with the USB. Uh, you want to go to controllers. And then you want to uh, type in plug in. Go to pad one. And basically what you want to do is, man, you want to press L1. And then just make sure that you do every one. So basically if you have an Xbox controller and it says L1 is basically LB. Uh, R1, RB, you know, it's, it's, basic, it's basic math, man. That's, that's all you have to do. Uh, so right now I'm just showing y'all this is how you do it. As you see here, uh, I'm going ahead and I'm doing everything. So once you finish everything, you want to press apply and then press OK. Um, I'm going to be making another video on the games, on uh, how to download games. What you want to do right here, if you already have a game downloaded, go to ISO selector, browse. I have my PS2 games in a separate folder. So let's go and we're going to go ahead and click, uh, let's say, Jet Li Rise of Honor. Gonna open that up, boot it full, and here it is. All right, y'all, man, as y'all can see, I'm playing uh, Def Jam Fight for New York. I meant to play Jet Li, but I wanted to go ahead and play uh, Def Jam. Man, I hope y'all enjoyed this video, though. Uh, it, this website, I'm going to show y'all on um, how to download games, how to do the memory card. But man, y'all can relive y'all childhood memories with these games, man. This, this, this is... This really feels like I'm playing a PS2. Really uh, better graphics as well. So, um, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and do this little special move, man, and then I'm gonna show y'all how to, uh, I'm gonna show y'all how to uh, exit out as well. Come here, man. There we go. Yeah, man, after that, after y'all want to quit, after y'all done with everything, press escape. And then, like I said, man, here it is right there. That's the main menu of the PCX S2. So, I hope y'all enjoy. And once again, it's your boy, Dallow Magic. And I'm going to see y'all when I see y'all. I'm out.